I think it's um, beyond art. Like, as for me, you know, beyond art, well, it's just, um, it's so needed. I, I, I lost my mom during the pandemic. It, ha it happened very suddenly, very fast. I didn't expect that. And I couldn't be with her. It was, you can't, ex I can't even say how tragic it is. And um, having this opportunity to actually, I think the Mirna was the first person not from the family that I had a chance to talk about my mom. And I found it really, I found like it was really needed for me. I needed that. I need this heal, needed this healing. And then when I could share the pictures, I, I spent the time, I actually took this time to, to look at my mom's life again, to, to look at the pictures that describe her the most, what I loved about those pictures, why, uh, why this, why not something else. And uh, so it was a kind of a process of creation for me as well, even though it was in my pictures, it was only the pictures of my mom. But the way I wanted to show her to the world, the way I saw her and the, the, her qualities, um, it was it just absolutely like it's so amazing for me to have this opportunity and really help with my grieving process and um, help me to speak up because. Uh, you are you you you're left off speechless. Like I I I was in shock when when I found out she she passed. I and I I wasn't I I couldn't talk. I couldn't talk about it for a long time. And uh, I'm very grateful for this. And the installation looks so amazing. I love the idea of the river. I I, I feel deep connection to this. The, as Mirna said that the there is no end to love, right? So it is very important in grieving to, to find that find that for ourselves. And also the, the, the pictures of the river and it's really, you know, this one one picture, all of them are amazing, but one one the picture you showed in the beginning when there are some like weeds, right? And then there's this river like uh, all this shape and aliveness and it's and it's beautiful and exactly yes. And, and and it's so beautiful to to think about life like that the same way, right? So um, there is this um, uh, uh, stable thing like body, trees, and something. And there is the there is the water that is the we see, we can see the constant movement, and then the water goes to the sea, and then to the ocean, and it all come together as one in the end. And I, this is beautiful. And I, I, I just, um, um, I think this is amazing. Like this, thank you, Mirna, for doing this. And also, uh, just because this based on the idea, like the the water as well, the the flow. I personally find the the flow of the emotions that I grieve, like you know, it goes through me, right? So it's wonderful. And I just wanted to say how grateful I am to and have this opportunity and how important that is in the process of uh, accepting the fact of the lost loved ones and trying to live with that and, and having the opportunity to, uh, to, share, to share a story of my mom with other people. It's, um, I, I can't say enough how important that is. So if you didn't do it yet, I highly uh, recommend, if I can say recommend in this, but, but yes, if you, if you have, um, if you're grieving, if you, you feel pain, you want to, um, you want to move it, you want to let it, you know, swim, you let it flow and, 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 and just um, sit with it too and deal with it. I think it's, it's amazing to, have this opportunity to um, send Mirna some photos and then she can uh, sh she's such an amazing artist and uh, I, I think you never will regret it it's like it's, it's so again thank you so much Mirna for inviting me and 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 taking the pictures of my mom and one more thing I know I'm talking a lot 
But I just wanted to say that Mirna was so amazing when, <laughs> when we were talking, you know. She spent so much time to, I sent her pictures, and then she said, oh, my God, I see this and this. And then we start, you know, talking. So the, the interaction was so amazing that, you know, you, you read all the, all the things that I want you to, to see. And then, oh, I can see your mom smile, and I can see that she's doing this and this. And, and I was so happy to, to, that someone who I barely know, honestly, we, I don't think we ever met in person yet, right? And, and, and I felt such a beautiful connection and I felt that I'm being understood and it's, it's something really amazing. So it's not like, uh, because what we share here is very personal and, and when, when someone like wouldn't have this approach as you have, Mirna, like, right, just like kind of, I'm doing exhibitions, send me pictures and no, but there's absolutely full attention on you and the person that you lost from Mirna and it's not like it's a uh, it's, it's it's really unbelievable and and I'm so so amazed with uh, your approach to this subject as well right so thank you for this thank you for your heart thank you for your art and thank you for having me as well <laughs> no, thank you Marta thank you <laughs> yeah, I mean this is this is not mine it's yours it's, it's with you and, and some others that are already trust me, her stories, their stories is because this exists. It's, it's not, it's empty, right, a river. And so it's thank you. And thank you for, for uh, joining this afternoon and acknowledging <laughs> that what I aim in is so, uh, sometimes I need, like I say, yes, it's working, you know, it's uh, helping me. Uh, because it's, it's not, it's not for my glory. It's not for, it's not for the photographs. They are just the scenery. So thank you, Marta. <laughs>